Alright, hey guys, Daly here, and today we're going to take a look at my, I don't know what to call this, Rabbit Dragons, but it's like a Chaos version that runs Dark Flare, or Samord, Dark Samord, it's really weird, but it's a pretty fun deck to play, so, um, I guess we'll just go into it. First off, we got Triple Ives and Dark Dragons, um, this is your normal monsters for your Rabbit, uh, 22,000 attack, being like the highest attack of any of the normal monsters you can grab. Also being a light target for your BLS. A Luster Dragon, 1900 attack, a win target for Dark Samord. And then you got your one, your one BLS. Two Dark Samords is your boss monsters, basically. Uh, two Dodger Dragons, 1900 attack, beater. And your opponent can't chain like warning or judgment to this, so if you need to push for a game with this somehow, and they're just going to like judgment and save them or something, they can't do that. And they can't activate counter traps the rest of the turn, meaning if you do have the option to make something and that you feel like you're going to need a judgment or a warning, they can't do anything to stop it. So it's pretty good tech in here. Um, he's also a light. He's also a win for um, your dark morning. He's also a target to drop red MD with because they can't negate a summon. Then we got two veilers for st your kind of just like salt to stop your opponent's plays. Obviously, he's also a light target which you need for Gor for BLS. One Gors, triple Kwaki Miro Dragos. If you know what this card does, is uh, you, each turn you have to you do, or during your end phases you reveal one Iron Core of Kwaki Miro Aru. In your hand, or reveal one dragon type monster in your hand, and then light and dark monsters can't be su special summoned while this guy's on the field. Then we got one night assailant, one red MD, two rest, two rest your rabbit, um, and then your tour guide engine here with Sanyan, two, two tour guides, and the night assailant. Then you got double triad, a pot of avarice to recycle your graveyard, and one dark hole, one heavy, one monster born, two MSTs, and one duality. Trap on up, double bottomless, double compulse, one selling judgment, one warning, one road. I made my uh, side deck really to counter Merla or my uh, trap lineups really counter Melantians because they're the only deck that I feel like I'll have a lot of trouble with. Maybe um, wind ups, but even then I have outs within the fact that I'm running uh, Drago in this doors and try to get the hand traps I need. Merlantians will give me more trouble than that though. Then we got Cataster, Stardust, Stardust for the Starlight Road, and maybe to come with like a Veiler and like your Gorge or something. And then Cataster because you have a lot of level fours and it's easy to make them. One Abyss Dweller, one Cowboy, one Kachi Kochi Dragon. One Levier, one Lightning Plover because you are main decking quite a few wind monsters. Uh, one Maestro to 17 engine, although if people don't know what Lightning Plover does is when this card is XYZ summon, target one set card of your opponent controls, return to the bottom of the deck. Once per you can detach one XYZ material from the starter target, once you face the card your opponent controls, return to the top of the deck. So he's basically like a Phoenix Wing Wind Blast or to hit face downs. Uh, one Maestro, one Shockmaster, one Acid Golem, one Black Shield of Corn, one Photon, one Photon Knight Palladius because you do get him off Algenda, right? One butter photon pet pillar operative butterfly, or one temp temple, and one zen mains. Um, it's just a deck I've started to test here and there, it's just for fun. I don't know if I'll make it in real life yet, but I do really like all the cards in here. They're all really cool. I feel like these are some of the more fun cards in the game. And they do set up a lot of fun combos, and there's a lot of just great, a lot of cool different things you can do with this deck. Um, that being said, uh, thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe, do all that, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and I will see you guys later. Thanks for watching.